Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jason Worley with WC Fab Side by Side. And behind us here today, we've got our new uh, RZR 1000 XP. As you know, we've had Honda Talon for a couple years now, and we decided to move on to our next model and start some design work with the Polaris Razors. So I wanted to show you a little bit today how some of our design process gets started so that we can get a setup in the computers for the engineers to start doing their CAD designs before we move out into the shop and actually start producing finished products. So we've got Riley over here, one of our engineers, and he is working with our ScanTech uh, blue light 3D scanning tool. You notice this machine's all polka dotted up. It's got a lot of uh, stick-on reflective labels. Before we get it out in the dirt and make a mess of it or before we roll it over or tear anything up too bad, we roll it right into the shop while it's still fresh and brand new. All the areas where we're going to build product for, where we need focus, let's say front bumper or rock sliders or lower control arms or radius rods, uh, roll cage, some of the main items we'll be working on first. We'll spend a lot of time focus on those areas, get all the fine detail, uh, right down to bolt hole locations, grabbing all the fenders and grill and everything like that so that we can design a bumper that, that looks sleek and matches the body lines really well. And this uh, blue light scan tool, latest and greatest scanning technology that we're using here, this unit grabs two million data points per second. It's, it's looking at each of these reflective pieces and waving that unit around slowly and grabbing millions and millions of data points and putting them into the computer and creating a, a 3D model, 3D image uh, of the part. And we can then import it into the computer and transfer it into our CAD programs so that we can start working on designing a new product. So we're really excited to uh, get you guys some uh, Polaris Razor parts. Uh, like we said, we got the XP1000 here we're starting with. 64-inch uh, wide version. Uh, we'll start with all the basic components, just like our Honda Talon line. And then uh, from there, we'll probably move into the Pro-R model and get into some of the wider, uh, wider machines as well. So stay tuned to the channel. We'll have some Polaris parts coming uh, in the coming months here, uh, once our engineers get up and rolling, and we'll start producing some, some parts and test fitting them and have them ready for you guys. Thanks a lot for tuning in. And if you got any questions, uh, feel free to leave a comment below.